In this video, I'm going to show you how to reset your device if for whatever reason you have any issues with the phone that requires it to be reset back to factory settings. Go ahead and watch the video and you'll see how to either manually factory reset it or how to reset it through the settings menu. Okay, first I'm going to show you how to factory reset through the settings menu. Turn the screen on, unlock the screen, bring up the app drawer, scroll to the bottom where settings is, click on settings, you're going to scroll, scroll towards the bottom, it's going to be backup and reset. Click on that and then it's going to be the option for factory data reset, you click on that. Now before you reset your phone, keep in mind this will erase everything on your phone, any pictures, any data you have, so make sure you back that up first. Hit reset phone, erase everything, and it's gonna do its thing and erase the whole phone. It's gonna set it back to factory settings. Now let's just say you have an issue with your phone that it doesn't allow it to completely boot up. You're gonna have to manually reset the phone. In order to do this, you're going to press the volume down key and the power button at the same time. Press and hold them. And then you're going to have this screen over here for the fast boot. Now you're going to use your volume key on the right side to scroll through and go to recovery mode. When you see recovery mode, click the power button. Now it's going to come to this screen that says no command. Now you're going to press and hold on the power button and click once on the volume up button and let go of them. You're going to come to this screen. It's going to give you the option for reboot system now. Reboot to bootloader. Apply update from ADB. Apply update from SD card. Wipe data factory reset. That's the one you're going to go for. You're going to scroll down to wipe data factory reset. It's going to tell you if your phone is reset, you'll need to enter the Google account information, email address, and password associated with this phone to be able to use it again. So keep in mind, if you had, for example, a passcode on here and you were logged into your Google account or had a Google email signed in, it's going to FRP lock the device, meaning if you're not the original owner of the device and you don't know the password for the original Google account that was used last on this account, or I mean last on this device, it's going to lock it. So you're going to need that information, your Google password and Google email. So before you do this, make sure you have that information or you're going to lock the device. Then you're going to click on the power button to select it. It's going to ask you again. It's going to say wipe all user data. You're going to have the options of no, user data only, or user data and personalized content. So you're going to click on the last one, user data and personalized content. And it's going to wipe the entire phone back to factory settings. And then you're going to go reboot system now, hit the power button. And you're done. Now the phone will turn on and it'll be factory reset.